global augmented reality project is looking for talents and you can join it. Augmented reality trends and best use cases are in our second episode of Weekly Dose of AR. Stay tuned! The Arcona team is growing and we are hiring more professionals from different tech spheres to foster the development of our global ecosystem. Our team is recruiting experienced developers in Computer Vision and SLAM who will accelerate the implementation of the Arcona Core and the process of scaling the AR projects across the planet. Show your skills, help us get bigger, better, faster, stronger, and be part of our team. We are also expanding the team of 3D artists. They will face the most interesting tasks to design AR projects for you, and these projects will be placed on your digital lens all around the world. If you know extraordinary specialists, please let us know. Another direction is the improvement of blockchain technology of the Arcona platform. We are looking for people who like challenges. We have to solve a lot of non-standard issues related to internal circulation of the token, decentralized data storage, and various nuances of copyright registration. Are you ready to scream, challenge accepted? Then you are our man, or a woman. Anyone interested in cooperation and joint development of the global augmented reality ecosystem, please, Contact us via email support at arcona.io and we're looking forward to meeting you. 2019 will bring a lot of new augmented reality software and hardware as well as new features. For example, new AR capabilities for multiplayer or as it is called shared AR. This functionality will let users see and interact with AR content simultaneously from different devices. It means that you can, for instance, take part in the same quest or a game or just see the same AR installation together with a friend or a group of people that accompanies you without any obstacles. Besides shared AR, this year will also be about the precision of AR installations and their fixed position in a specific area and location. AR will definitely be a new marketing channel and will be used in advertising and this is more creative and interactive approach for people learning about new product and the ways of using it. For example, you can see how the item looks like a new room as IKEA used it with its furniture or even bodies. The best examples are of makeup products and even tattoos. The easiest way to access AR will still be a cell phone, you know. So more mobile devices will have integrated AR and hardware will become cheaper and faster with a reduced side effects such as heating up. Boom. And you even can go crazy with the AR and substitute with the real world, with the virtual one. But just remember that technologies were created to make our lives better and not replace it. <laughs> Another good and really helpful example of AR is definitely training. In order to become a professional, you need to train for about 10,000 hours. This is quite a number, a crazy number. This process takes a lot of time and effort, and if we talk about industries, sometimes you need to make a lot of mistakes to learn new things, but there is no place for mistakes. This is where AR comes in handy and can literally save a lot of time and be great medium for acquiring new skills, right? The US military and Walmart understood this and Microsoft has made a 480 million deal with the US Army to train troops for a complex, dangerous real-world situation via AR. And Walmart has partnered with Oculus and Store VR to teach personnel internal processes in an immersive AR-enabled way. That was our weekly dose of AR with the news we are excited about. Share your ideas in the comments below and we will gladly jump into the conversation. Have a nice day and stay tuned for our updates and may AR be with you.